Hey Diamonds, welcome back. As requested, my Dewy Glowy Skin routine, and I start with the MAC Prep and Prime, and I mix that with the MAC Strobe Liquid, which has bronzer in it. Um, I'm sad because I'm halfway done. My favorite foundation currently is the BB Cream Nude from Dior Skin, and I mix that with the Soleil Tan de Chanel Illuminizer in Sundance, or Sunkissed. <laughs> I use the bottom of the brush to mix it on the back of my hand. I place what's left there on the face and then I begin to buff it in with the bristles of the brush. Now I do spray the brush brush with um, Max Fix Plus which our hair is rumored to be discontinued. I don't know how I feel about that. I have never tried their um, the mineral mineralized Fix Plus or charged water Fix Plus. I don't know about that. So I'm going to have to load up on this stuff. So I'm just going to blend that into the skin and put it all over the place wherever you need. Um, it's very lightweight. It's also buildable coverage as well if needed. Now the next thing I'm going to do is use the Kevin Aquan Face Skin Enhancer. I am SX11 and I use this to highlight, if you will. Um, use it under my eyes, on the bridge of my nose, uh, Cupid's bow, and on my chin. I don't place it above on my forehead at first. I kind of use what's left on the brush because I really don't like like the dead center of my, my forehead being a <laughs> bright light, if you will. So I'm using an Estee Lauder brush. You can use whatever brush suits you. That's just the one that I was sitting in front of me. I'm going to blend that down once I have it placed to where I want that uh, light, the center of attention on the face. I'm going to place it there and then I'm going to take the foundation brush that I used for my foundation and I'm just going to blend that out. And what I will actually do is I will actually go over the concealer. So it's not as bright as it actually looks and it can blend in better with the uh, foundation. I haven't added any more product to the brush. I know it looks a little bit crazy, but once it's all blended out and everything, it's good. Oh, if I'm looking to the side, that's because I'm addicted to House MD on Netflix right now. How come nobody told me about that show? <laughs> now it's time to set it, and I'm using this setting powder from Wet n Wild, the Fergie Center Stage Collection. And it's white, and it has little shimmers. Um, it's a translucent powder, basically. And I'm just going to use that to set under my eyes only. That's really the only um, concealer area that I set. Now I'm going to go in with Double Definition Extra Dimension Skin Finish from MAC and I'm going to highlight tops of my cheekbones. I kind of OD with that. I'm also going to go down the bridge of my nose, on my chin, um, and the Cupid's bow. Another product that I use are the other Extra Dimension Skin Finish. It's really superb. Whisper of Guilt is great, but I do have these other ones and I do rotate between all of them. Now I'm going to take this Rocket Republic powder in Angora and I'm just going to use that to contour the hollows of my cheek, the, my chin, um, my forehead, and I will also use that to contour my nose. I think I, I, I got too much <laughs> highlight on my nose. It's glistening. I love to glow, but I think on the tip of my nose. <laughs> Fix Plus is another, another factor in the glow, guys. It really does give your skin that glow and that glisten. And here you go. Thank you for watching, guys. Bye-bye.